Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves in Hollister, Missouri. With JC News Now, as he stands around and audits a uh, medical marijuana dispensary and ends up getting well socked for his uh, troubles and he tries to complain to the police but the police are not being very helpful because all he has apparently is a tiny little scratch to show for it but he's still not happy about it and he's threatening lawsuits so in other words, a massively butthurt frauditor. So let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. What's up, everybody? JC News Now. Let's go check it out. Now, uh, I am just going to fast forward through this part because he just stands here talking to himself about other First Amendment auditors, trying to give them credit for uh, his own journey. So, let's just go ahead and, like I said, fast forward. That's much too early. Prepare to fast forward. Preparing to fast forward. Fast forward. Fast forwarding, sir. No, I'm good. good. Is there anything I can help you with, though? No, I'm good. Sure. So you're just doing a, a, some sort of check or whatever you want to call them? I'm just doing a story. Sure, he's filming my customers is the problem. So I'm just curious what you were, why why that, you were filming my Why is that customers. a problem? That's fine. We can see. We'll just get the piece out here while we're inside. Okay, they'll tell you the same thing, but... Sure, we'll see what they'll tell you. Okay, we'll okay. see. Well, dude, not exactly in this case, considering that you end up getting trespassed and you have to leave. So, you're not very good at predicting the future, are you? I'll be right here. <laughs> well, we had contact. Let's see what the popo says. Man, is there something I can help you with? No, somebody just asked me that. Okay. Why are you filming our shop, man? I'm doing a story.
Pardon me, uh, sir, but uh, he's not doing a story. He's just doing something called Monkey See, Monkey Do. He sees a bunch of idiots on YouTube acting like a bunch of fools, so he figured he could try it himself. Doing a story? Okay, well, we'd appreciate it, and we'd be very grateful if you wouldn't film our shop. Okay, well, I'd be grateful if you wouldn't worry about it, because I'm going to go ahead and film it. Okay, is there any purpose for it? Yes. What's the purpose? I'm not going to divulge that until it's pu published. Well now, that's very unprofessional of you. Well, professional that you're uh, following the fraudulent script to the letter, but very unprofessional that you're talking this way to this dude. I mean, he looks like he could hurt you. He could put you down if he wanted to. In fact, that's what he's about to do here in the next few minutes. But he doesn't do too much to you. He just gives you a little bit of a love tap. Okay. Well, there's two ways we can go about this. I don't want to call the cops. You can call them. Okay. I don't mind. I'll wait right here. If you're calling them, I'll wait. I was almost done. But if you're going to call the cops, I'll wait. I prefer not to, man. Mm -hmm. I just want to know why you're filming our shop. It's a security issue to me. Do what you got to do. It's First Amendment right, buddy. I understand it's a First Amendment right. I'll tell you what, go on back in there and get back to work. Don't worry about what I'm doing. How's that? Nah, we ain't gonna do it that way, homie. Okay. I don't understand where the attitude's coming from, though. You know what I'm saying? All right, I'm gonna move right over here, because I don't want you up. You think he has a bad attitude? You should try out Glen Serio. Then you'll know what a bad attitude is. Homie, I don't want to have to... Oh, I ain't anything. up on you yet, homie. Is that, a th just... is that a threat? I ain't threatening you. Good thing. Or what? Because that'd be illegal. Look, dude, if you're coming here to start problems, man, I'm not. No you you walked it. up to me, man. I did because I'm wondering why you're filming me. our shop. I'm doing a story on your shop. Isn't that good enough? I'll stand out here with you, then. Okay, go ahead. I'll say your name. Jake. Cool. Okay. All right, man. We got Jake, y'all. It's a security issue. Yep. Welcome to the First Amendment, Jake. You can make a good thumbnail. Yeah? Yes, sir. Awesome. Would be the first time. Really? Alright, I'll film everybody who walks in and out, man. What's that? I'll film everybody that walks in and out. I'll come back tomorrow and do it too. Or you can go and get back to work and I'll be done in a few minutes. No, I mean, I ain't gonna sit out here and let you just film. I'm gonna call my boss. Okay. See what he says about it. Call whoever you want, man. What, right. what I'm doing is not only legal, it's protected. Yes, you've got the right to film out there. Yes, you've got the right to be a complete jackass but here's the thing when you get into a moral issue is it morally right to film anybody going in here to collect their medicinal goods especially since uh, some of them might not want to be on camera i mean some of them might not want to be on camera because well there might be somebody uh, trying to come after them and uh well, if they know where uh, they frequent, then they can use that to their advantage. You know, stuff like that. But uh, I guess you frauditors don't really think that way. Why are you shaking so bad? What's that? Are you shaking? Are you okay? Yeah, I've got nerve damage. Yeah, I do too. I, got, I feel you on that, man. Target acquired. <laughs> right back at you, buddy. You're number one, too. No, you won't. You're number one, too, buddy. Bam! 
Oh, we got an NC Tyrant Hunter wannabe here. Uh, but he knows how to play the game. Unfortunately, you don't. It's illegal. I need to sign something for you to use me in a video anyway. Sure you do, Puddin'. Go get in your car and leave. Well now, apparently you haven't been paying attention to what happened to other frauditors. I mean, you have to look at Georgia Transparency to understand that, uh, well, a privacy complaint can be issued if somebody knows her name and can identify the channel that this is on. Uh, well, she can file a complaint on your channel and bring your video down. Go leave. Thank you. Well, the dude in the black shirt back there is about to call the police on him. So let's go ahead and skip ahead to the confrontation and then we'll get to the police encounter. A little longer than a few minutes later. Why did you speak to me then? Because you got a freaking phone in my face. I'm not in your face, ma'am. There yeah, you are. You're taping me. Why? I'm 10 feet away from you. Why are you taping me? Uh, We're done. Don't put your hands on me. Or what? Or I'm going to defend myself, big boy. Yeah? Yep. Hey, Jacob, Jacob. Like, like says back you're back. opening up your so shop for liability. Uh, I know you're upset, you're buddy. Take, take a deep on. breath. Like, like said. <laughs> That's why he's trying to do the same thing like Westboro Baptist does. Uh, Westboro Baptist Church, that's a name I haven't heard in a long time. And they're not as relevant as they used to be, not since Fred Phelps died a number of years ago. <laughs> called me Westboro. I'm right here, big boy. Ain't nothing there but air between us. Fair enough, man. Jake, Jake. Jake. Oh. Okay, now you're under, you're going to get arrested. And, well, that's where the video ends, folks. But wait! There's more! Hang on to your seat, baby! Cause this one's a screamer! Many, many minutes later. He admitted that he grabbed onto you. Mm-hmm. Okay. So I'm gonna put detail everything in my report. Here's the thing. You are trespassed from this property. I'm on public property. Yeah. Doesn't matter if it's public or private, you can still be trespassed from it. That's one thing you frauditors need to learn and stop saying on camera because that's one thing that is not true. You can be trespassed from public property. You are. Mm -hmm. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to explain this to you very carefully though, okay? Okay. To save yourself some grief, save us all some grief. Okay. Okay. You have a right to record. Absolutely. Um, if somebody comes up to you, just say, hey, I just like making YouTube videos. Just explain it that way. If somebody's having a problem with it, just turn the other cheek, man. Just step away for a minute, then come back, do whatever you gotta do to avoid a confrontation. Last thing I want is another situation that's possibly escalated from what happened today got you okay because i don't want to have to have anybody taken to the hospital you know what i mean fair enough i'm gonna go over there now okay i'm feeling a little click and he busted my lip okay he did a felony assault i'm gonna file everything and see what the prosecutor has to say all right okay is he gonna be arrested today no sir no no sir because i don't have video evidence you have a little scratch on your mm -hmm. lip, but that's not, it's not actively bleeding. It, you're not, yeah, I don't even see any blood in your mouth, sir. No, I spit it out. Okay, so I'm going to go file my report, and we'll see what happens, all right? You, even with the video evidence. There's, it's not clear cut enough. It's, it's just not. Come on. Officer Douglas, what's your badge number? Have a better day. Okay, what, you're going to, can I get your badge number? And this is where I'm going to end it because all he does from here is whine, groan, and complain and threaten lawsuits and it doesn't get him anywhere. 
But dude, it's really all your fault. You were in the antagonist the whole time. You pushed and pushed and pushed until you got a response. Man, it wasn't exactly the response you were probably hoping for. But hey, if you want to go that route, well, be prepared for the consequences, dude. At any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one.